So you want to do gas chromatography. First of all, to do gas chromatography, you have to start with a gas. So let's say that this is a cylinder of nitrogen gas. Then you need your oven. Inside the oven, you have your capillary column, which is a very tiny uh, glass tube that's very, very long. Then you have to have a detector. Your detector in this experiment is flame ionization. So in order to make a flame, you need two more gas cylinders which have the fuel for the flame. One is oxygen and one is hydrogen. And those two fuels are mixed with what's coming off of your column in the detector which is called the flame ionization detector. To visualize the compounds coming off the column, you attach all of this to a computer. You're going to inject your sample here into the injection port using a syringe. The sample is going to travel through the column and come out to the flame ionization detector. Then the signal is going to be visualized on the computer as a series of peaks. gas chromatography.